did um, the last couple of days, um, I've got the, um, for the for the project roads, I've got the updated um, traffic data, right? Now I'll show you. Putting that traffic data into HTM4 is a very slow, laborious business. And you, if you've used Excel, I mean, I, I've, I've got an Excel spreadsheet. I, I play, you know, you play with the, the data, you get it all in the right form. Here it is. Now we want to put it into HTM4, and we copy. have to copy, paste, copy paste. not even. Not even copy paste. Okay, you can't okay. even copy paste. You know, you're just typing the bloody thing in, <laughs> and it's a pain. So, um, but but you can export and import the thing in in um, Microsoft Access da oh. database format. Well, Mac Microsoft Access isn't a nice program either, but but it's a lot easier. But at least you can manipulate it. So I've spent a day. Um, mm. Working out how I can get my ex data from my Excel spreadsheet into an Access database and into HTM4. It probably would have only taken me two hours to type it, but but I much, <laughs> much <laughs> prefer to to, uh, to to work out the, the way of doing it. So it, it for database it use um, Access. It we can use we can also use the SQL or other software for the storing the database. The database, the, if you export from here, it exports it as an as an access okay. the database. You can you can then so use, it, also you other can use any other database tool then to manipulate it. Yeah. But you then have to save it as an access database okay. and read it, to read it back in again. Okay. Yeah. So so the main import access is a good main software. import export is is is, a, is as access. Oh, yeah. So we should install also the access. Um, software in in our laptop in this laptop. You should do, yeah. Um, I mean, it's not it's not critical yeah. at this stage. Um, you know, you can you can learn, you can play with this without ever using Access, right? Mm -hmm. you, you, you can laboriously typing the changes in, right? But if you want to to, to manipulate large amounts of data. Mm -hmm. Then that's, because that, we then have a lot of roads. Yeah, that's and that's the way you do it. You yeah. put it, you you make it into and an access. As you database. told that it's uh, loving the data. <laughs> yeah. So that's why uh, we we should install. Access. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yes. That, um, that's the uh, and um, that's only in that only ha only happened in the latest version. Oh. The previous version used DB4. Previous version DB4. Okay. Yeah. Um, and and there are some, some and, and there are some problems. It, it, it wasn't designed this way. It was designed for manual input and, ex, and out and, and, and export. Um, so so, the, but but for the main databases, um, you can you can just put them into access. So that's so that's good. So you, so your main road database. You can do that way. Just for my information, mm -hmm. can we? I mean, upload data, or can we uh, attach data with the GPS and IRI data with the um, uh, profilometer. Digital profilometer, and then automatically it will convert to that data to a internet uh, service. Can it support it or not? Can we we are, we are putting just by manually in this software that you import. They, um so all of the data is attached it's, to our internet. It is definitely not automatic. It's not automatic. It's not automatic. It's something that that with a little bit of playing around, yeah. you should be able to get to work, right? What you will have to do is you'll have to get the data off your um, profile. Profile limiter. Profile limiter. Um, and that comes out in what? Excel or? No, it's uh, another file. What is the extension of profile meter? It's Excel file. It's probably it, 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 it's it, it's almost certainly a database file. Just like Excel Something. sheets or maybe it will be similar to that. Similar to Excel. Yeah, okay. it, it'll it'll be a database. Well, file. What we have to do is to convert it to Access and then from there. You got to convert it to Access and then you got to write a a query in Access. Okay. That will query it and read it into the right place. So it's a very laborious yeah. um, 
but it, I mean, it, it's something that it, it, if you got if you got somebody around that knows how to, how to use access and knows knows how to do queries in access, they should be able to write it for you. Um, me, I, um, I, I I do these things out of um, necessity. Uh, well, everybody has to go and, from necessity. Um, <laughs> and, and um, and 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 I and I only do it very occasionally. So every time I need I need to do it, I'm I'm learning again. <laughs> yes, that's, well, we have to learn again again yeah. if you're not using. Um, but <clears throat> it's it's one of these things. Once you know once you know how to do it, it's easy. <laughs> Is it need the traffic count data? Um, the traffic count data is is a, is a separate access database. No, uh, it, uh, as a AGM input data. Yeah. Yes. Is it required the traffic count data? Yes. And the FWD data, FWD data, filing weight deflectometer data. They. That is for the condition of the room. The condition. The, yeah. yeah. You you have to pro, you have to process it into the right. In, into the right data that's, that's put in. And we have another uh, equipment which is uh, JFR, ground radar penetration. No, that is not required. Uh, well, those you different the, layers of, yeah. You, 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 I'll, I'll, I'll show you what the data is, yeah. is step there, by step in, in, in there now. Yeah. Um, those It uses that information, but yeah. probably not in the form that it comes out of your <laughs> your machine. Yeah, we will, so we, we will you, change it. You have, to, you have to process it, and then and, and then it's a. Then so it required a lot of expert knowledge. Uh, it's not in ordinary uh, um, they, uh, software, I mean, <laughs> you, as you told. One of one of the things that it's, that's one one of the one of the things that's in the uh, road database is the thickness. Yeah, oh, take us. Okay, and that's what your radar what's it will, will give yeah, you. Yeah. Okay. So so so, so it will give you that key data, and that's key data. Yeah. yeah. So it, it so yeah. it use. And, and, and the other other piece of information it uses is the. You have to read it from the data. Nobody understands it. How do you read those yeah. the ground yeah. penetration? The, 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 the other the other piece of data it has is the structural number. SN number. Yeah. And and you get that from your falling weight detectometer. Yeah. Okay. Again, through a formula. So, so WWD data is also. Yeah. So, at at one stage, FWD is in uh, raw form and it will convert to SN number and SN number is the input data. Yeah. 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 So, so we have we should work uh, to for also for inputting data to be and we should uh, have a lot of work. Yeah. To be done. Yeah. And. Um, Yeah, you, you, it's, it, it's a big program it's a to, big to do, um, but if you've got if you've got a, if 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 we if you set it up as an automated system for getting the data yeah, in, right? So so basically, if 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 you you've got the data that's that's come from your FWD, um, you you might. Just process that using an ac using access, um, and then you have a query from that which puts it into the form that that, that you read into mm -hmm. HTML4. Then you can gradually update your FWD data, and, and each time you've got some new a, a new block of data, then you just read it in. Mm -hmm. um, so, and it, so the first time is very hard, but after after that it, you, sh you should it should be relatively easy. Um, so, go on to the software. Okay. And so, so it's very. <laughs> so our interest is now getting more to to uh, investigate uh, the software. <coughs> so you're going to drive it. Uh, open, open up the vehicle, please. Okay. Okay. Yeah. All right. So. So we have, um, I think, 13 types of, of vehicle in here. 
we have 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 and 14 yep. we have uh, another one is 14 14 okay so all right i think it's uh, it depend on us <laughs> yeah to, to you you can you, you can change these yeah. um and i'm not not i don't think any of your detection equipment is 